Welcome back to my short movie review show. Right now I'm doing Assault on Precinct 13, the original John Carpenter movie. This movie I would give 4 out of 5 stars, so I definitely recommend it. Basically, it's kind of like Night of the Living Dead, only with that, this one doesn't have zombies, it has gang members. And they're all coming towards this little police station that's starting to go, starting to go out of business or they're moving to another place. And it's the last day and night that they're going to be open. And it's just gang members swarm in. There's even, at one point, some criminals that are taken to this, this precinct by other cops. And they think it's safe to hold them there, and it's not. And it becomes just a crazy free-for-all of gang members trying to get in. And just, I would recommend it. But uh, it's not one of my favorite John Carpenter movies, although I would watch it again, a 4 out of 5. My favorite John Carpenter movies are They Live and, like, Escape from L.A., Escape from New York series. But this, definitely, I would watch again. If you like Night of the Living Dead, you'll like it. And the acting is really good. I love the way, I love the music in John Carpenter's movies. That always, that always is great. You know, he's a great musician also aside from being a great classic director. There's not much else I could say about the movie, although I will say that you will like it. It's a little violent. There's a very violent scene. I won't get into it because I don't want to say what happens, but just be aware of that. If you can get make it past that, you'll like it. And if you like Night of the Living Dead, definitely check this one out, guys. Four out of five stars. Assault at... Is it on? Yeah. Assault on Precinct 13 or... Assault at Precinct 13. I believe it's Assault on Precinct 13. Thank you guys for watching. I really enjoy doing these movie reviews. And as soon as I can uh, rent Pledge This and Battlefield Earth, I will have those reviews up. So thank you so much for your support. Please hit that thumbs up button for me. Subscribe if you want. If not, you know, you don't have to subscribe as long as you watch my videos. I'd rather have people just watch my stuff. But it's great that if you want to subscribe, I mean, go ahead, that'd be great too. But it's just, when is it all about subscribers? I've noticed, like, the sub for sub thing, you know, when I first started, I was curious about it, but you get, like, 300 subscribers, and the people, half the people don't even watch the videos. So what's the point of having all these subscribers? I'd rather have people, subscribers that watch my stuff, that enjoy my stuff. I don't want to just tell someone to subscribe just to tell them, and I'll subscribe back. I want someone to be able to like my stuff and subscribe because they want to see my videos. Just like I do that to people. People I enjoy watching, I subscribe, okay? So what is this whole sub for sub thing? Um, I don't like it. But uh, thank you so much, guys. I love you all. Peace.